Today I'll show you how to install and use the Quick Chromatic Aberration plugin for After Effects. This free plugin basically allows you to add cinematic vintage lens distortions very quickly in a few clicks. So to download it, click on the link below and once you're on this website, click download, add to cart. If you don't want to tip the developers, type zero here and click on get. Now to install it on your computer, after extracting the folder, double click on it. If you're on Mac, copy this folder, but if you're on Windows, right click this folder and click copy. Head over to your After Effects shortcut and right click it. Choose the option open file location and locate the folder that's called plugins. Open it up, then paste what you've copied there. Now launch After Effects and by the way, After Effects should be closed during this whole thing, but you should see the plugin just chilling in your effects and presets panel. To demonstrate to you how to use this plugin, well, it's very simple, just drag it onto your video or image file. It can be used when adding effects onto your text as well. Leave a like if you wanna see some text tutorials with this plugin, but anyways, you can already see the difference if we zoom in, even without tweaking any settings, which is very good in my opinion. However, I'll change some of these settings here. Later. So what I did was, I added 5 degrees to the hue shift, made the position value 2.0, added 5 degrees to the rotation setting, and here's how the footage looked beforehand, and here is how it looks now. We can also expand the setting right here and increase the distort aberrate a little bit or we can just keep it as it is. And we can also add some blur as well. And uh, yeah, that's about it. If you found this video helpful and you want to see more videos about other cool plugins, drop a like and subscribe.